Ooh wee, Big Mo. Welcome to the Lawn Stars, guys and gals. Oh man, it gets here in the hot, nasty dog days of summer, and it's just drags on, and you're just you're starting to get burnt out. You know, it happens, and it can be easy to uh, forget things. For instance, have you ever forgotten your uh, mixed gas can and left it at home? <laughs> Yeah, that's not pleasant. Uh, bet, I bet some of you have done that for sure, at least once. And uh, yeah, it's just real easy, real easy to forget stuff. We've even forgotten, believe it or not, um, been driving down the road from a job and look up in the mirror and be like, where in the, is the mower? Yeah, left the mower at jobs before. Oh, stuff like that can happen. Hadn't happened in a long time, but it can happen. Um, but I tell you, the other day I was out here mowing the, some of these yards around my house. And I had my safety glasses using them, and I forgot to put them back in the truck. So I took them in the house. And since that's not, see, I have like a, a little checklist where I try to, okay, you have the you have the weed eaters, you have the mixed gas, you have the blower, you have the mowers before I leave. But safety glasses is usually not on the list <laughs> because they're kept in the truck. But <clears throat> when I do something like that where I take them in the house, it's easy for me to leave them, and I did. So uh, I had to dig out some behind the seat, some old crappy safety glasses, and it sucked because... I uh, didn't have these beauties. Yeah, that's what I want to talk to you about now, since we're talking about glasses, uh, are these Toro Field glasses that they sent me. Uh, Toro heard you landscapers requests, and they delivered with these. They, they wrap around, and they are uh, just love, love these glasses. And I'm not blowing smoke up your paw up. Um, I really genuinely love these. They sent these to me like months ago and I uh, wanted to use them. You know, I don't like to um, just get them out of the mail and then uh, just do the review just to get some glasses. I want to actually use them for a good long while and, and test them out and then do a review of them. I think that's the fair thing to do and i really love these glasses i've loved all the toro products they just uh, last i just pass mine down to you know like when i'm get a new pair from toro i'll pass it down to to uh jr and he wears them and then i'll wear the new ones and i tell you they're uh spectacular and I'm not not joking one bit. They uh, last longer than any glasses. Uh, you know they they'll cost you a little bit. You know they're not like going to hopping into the Walmart and buying a pair of safety glasses. <clears throat> you know they're uh, they'll cost you a little bit, but they're worth it because they last far far longer than any glasses uh, safety glasses that I've other brands that I've had before in the past and get this they are backed by a lifetime guarantee you can't beat that they're back for a lifetime guarantee if something happens to them you send them back I mean I don't know how it works but you could find out online because I've never had to send them back because they last um, but yeah just uh, you do some process and they send you another pair you know they're guaranteed um, they have a lot of styles they have the valley they have the range which I have a couple pair of excellent glasses they have the range XL for you guys with big fat heads <laughs> yeah I mean I know some of you uh, you know let's say uh, the Chattanooga Ninja we all know he has a big big head and he would have to have some XL, so, you know, that works out. And um, 
Also, of course, the field glasses, which I have right here. And they have a new, a new style, which is H, the HD collection. Hopefully I can get my hands on uh, a pair of those and do a review of those. That, that sounds interesting. I've heard some good things, but they come in the, the, the lenses. You can get fire red, Baja blue, silver, C3 and C4 smoke lenses. Um, here's some of the specs, you know, on my pair, the, uh, the field glasses. Um, this is kind of the size you got going on there. Um, they're shatter resistant lenses. Okay. They're lightweight. They're very lightweight. I love that. And, um, they have TR90 shape memory frames, you know? So I guess it keeps them from breaking, man. Cause I mean, there's so many, you know, I, it's funny. I was looking through the, the, like I said, when I left these at home, I was looking through um, the back part of the, behind the seat of the truck there for something to put on my eyes. Cause I'm, I don't want to go uh, raw dogging it with my eyes. Um, and I came across pair after pair that were broke, you know, the, uh, this part was tore off or uh, lens was broke or, you know, they were just broke all the pieces. And I finally found one and it had the nose pieces missing and it sucked, but you know, it protected my eyes for the day, but I couldn't wait, couldn't wait to get my Toros back. So yeah, guys, if you're looking for a great, great pair of safety glasses, you can't go wrong. I would recommend for you guys, um, since you are landscapers, you know, if that's, if you are a landscaper watching this, I would recommend the field because they, uh, wrap around and protect you really well. But that's it guys. Um, yeah. If you want a good pair of glasses, go get you some Toros. But now let's go mow something and then we'll talk some more afterwards. You know, how, you know the drill. Let's do it. Let's do it, baby. Woo. One, two. Listen.
It has been a hot, nasty, humid day. And I've had it with this heat. Anyway, I get off work. I call my buddy up. Oh, Doc Shane. Oh, Shane from DLT Lawn Care. I call him up thinking, you know, I'm gonna shoot the crap with him a little bit. How you doing, buddy? How was your day? Oh, blah, blah, blah. How was yours? Well, what's the first thing I get in my ear? Where's my money? He wants his money, okay. If you watched a couple videos ago, we stayed in one of his many country chalets. And uh, yes, he charges a fee, even for his friends. And to be honest, it's pretty high. You know, might as well be just doing it through somebody else. But anyway, uh, I told him I was gonna get his money to him, you know, so I just sent it, I just got it to him venmo it to him with a little something something extra just to shut him up and uh i mean you can't even call your friend up you know he has to have that money he's money hungry very rich guy very 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 rich i'm just kidding that's all bull crap I didn't really stay, He'd, it wasn't really his place. You know, it's all a joke. That's what this channel is. It's, we're jokesters. <laughs> but uh, actually, Shane is very poor. That's right. So I hope that all of you can go over to his page when he's doing a live and uh, super chat him as much as you can because the man can, he can barely pay his bills. I'm just saying. So please go over there and maybe go to one of his videos and hit the thanks button, <laughs> you know, just to help him out. Uh, sorry, old man. Anyway, I want to uh, end this video with Big Mo's Just the Tip. <laughs> yeah, that's all you're getting. <laughs> um, so Big Mo's t Just the Tip today goes out to people that have, I don't know if you're in this situation or not, but I am and I, I know some of you are. Um, do you go in a neighborhood and spend hours upon hours just mowing one yard to the next. You get in one neighborhood, you don't, you don't unload and load the mower, you just go from one to the next. Uh, just bam, 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 bam. Well, if that is you, you, maybe you should listen to this tip. By the end of the day, there could be some quality loss right it could happen you know because you're hurrying you're you're you see that finish line you know and you're wanting to get done you want to get in that cool truck and you want to get home so it could make you rush a little bit i'm not calm down I'm not saying necessarily it's you but it could happen well something that you can do to combat that is maybe just maybe just do it backwards. You know, start at the other end than you normally start. Show the last yards a little of that freshy, fresh love that you have at the beginning of the day. And uh, maybe it could equal things out a little bit. Maybe, uh, maybe that would make the difference in their day. You know, you never know. They might come home and go, hmm, looks a little better today. Yeah, that long guy, he's awesome. But anyway, thank you for hanging out to the end of this video. We love every one of you. Please be safe out there. Uh, really, seriously, take care of yourselves. It's these hot, hot summer days, man. We're, we're all getting burnt out. I'm right there with you. Big Mo's right there with you. Just hang in there. Let's all hang in there together and just push through to the end of the season and then we can then we can rest rest our bones but 
now I must bid you adieu. And uh, so that means until next time, Big Mo signing off. Beep. One, two, three, listen. Beep.